Tyler, Rusty Claim Garage. It is apparently gonna start pouring. Um, it was supposed to be light rain for like 40 minutes, but yeah, it's coming in and out. Anyway, I'm gonna do the spark plugs today. I've been working all day, just got home. So I'm gonna spend a couple hours. I think Sean's coming by. I'm gonna do the spark plugs, check out the distributor, see if I can get it running. And probably get very, very wet. We got NGK V Power spark plugs, uh, just whatever ones. I like NGK, I use them in my Audi. So, four of those in. Start with the hardest ones in the back first. I don't know how I'm gonna get that one. It'll be fun. I guess swivel extension. An engine may have a lot of space, it sure does take a lot of effort to reach the spark plugs. Okay. Yep. This one's pretty nice. I think it I think it was time to be replaced. Sean's here <laughs> in his working running classic truck. <laughs> Slightly less clean. More of a muscle. Uh, it big big truck make fire. Big fire. Big fire. It's getting fuel though. I can see it spraying in the car. So it's got to be something to do with sparks or air. Yeah, well, there's the first one I pulled. It's a little, it's a little it's carbony. <laughs> you have to do the hand thing to make it. Oh, I, I just found out about that the other day. It's special. Oh, that's that's actually not bad at all. They're auto lights though, so. And a change the firing order. Um, mine doesn't like NG2s. No? No. Yeah, but I, put, I put AC Delco's in it and it runs better. Mine probably won't like close to anything. I, mean, this one just oh, I got some shit on the front of the truck here. Oh, God. What is that? There's some shit right there. You see that? This is all my dad's old Bronco. Was that really? Yeah. What, has it been living in the basement? It was in the back shed. Oh. He had one of his guys make it for him like 30 years ago. Mm -hmm. The Bronco's a real vehicle. Yeah. Sorry, I got distracted by it. What the fuck is this? Why is there a red wire going to the AC? Or is it just taped there for no reason? Okay. What is, what is this? What are you? I haven't investigated oh my God. any of this. Oh, I don't like it. No. Not good, Tyler. Not you know, good. You know what's not good is this fuel. It's like yellow. And, you know, that probably has to do with whatever it mixed with in that can that I just blindly used without checking out. I did change the fuel filter and the hose that melted to the header. Yeah. That's going to catch on fire. Right? Which one? The, that fuel filter. Oh, the glass one? Yeah. It's going to shatter. And I had one on a dirt bike and it was great. And then the first time I put it in a vehicle, uh, yeah. It like cracked on its own, like it was suspended like that, and it just got cracked. I don't know if it's heat or what. And it decided to spew fuel everywhere. 
All right, we'll, we'll change. We'll change. It's fine. Later. It's good for now. I mean, for testing purposes. Yeah, you can use it in line for like now, but you know what? I'm just gonna get under here and crank my hog. So. <laughs> Slap the clam. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. You gotta censor that. <laughs> what? I, I, loved it. I don't remember what I was watching, but there was something, uh, something on YouTube where they were like, they censored COVID, but said shit. <laughs> and I was like, you can say shit, but not COVID. What? You don't remember the dark times. They don't yeah. remember the dark times. Actually, some people don't. It's smeared on. Yeah. It's factory. I'm starting to I'm starting to get a little concerned. <laughs> the whole firewall it's, it is bad. It's the gas pedal is on a piece of like on a piece of metal that's about to give away. Like you're pressing more of the firewall than you are the gas pedal when you're in there. So Fine. There, there's gonna be a lot of metal work. It'll be cab off. Cab off restoration. I'm especially uh, something this quality. Everything except for the front of the cab, metal-wise, mm -hmm. is good. Yeah. Just the floor and the firewall. Yeah, well, I mean, it's got, like, the, the vent thing here. I think... That's just letting water trap. Yeah. It's supposed to sit over this grating here, but I think it... It's off a little bit. And, this full, and that's full of leaves and shit. So do you want the bad news? What's the bad news? We had it running on shitty plugs. So yeah. it's not likely that replacing the spark plug is going to help. No, probably not. Other than quality of life wise. I could have accidentally twisted the um, distributor also when I was removing the vacuum line while I was back there. Okay. So uh, verify firing order, I guess, is what I should probably do while you're playing with plugs. Sure. Okay. I think it's, I think it's right. Uh, I had to switch the one and the five. Gotcha. Because the five was where it isn't was here, yeah. which is the first position. Yeah, allegedly. Allegedly. Yeah. Okay. Dep unless it's one eighty out underneath, right? Isn't right. It? it could be one eighty out, or yeah, it could be. One. Freak rainstorms over. Yeah, I drove through it. You're not gapping the plugs. No. I mean, I was checking them out to make sure they're not like touching. Yeah. It's got a gap. It's, it's got a gap. Yeah. It's, it's not hard. ready to settle down yet. So. <laughs> yeah, it's just checking out its options. It's, you know, it's just figuring it out. Don't cross that. Don't cross that. Oh my god, it went in like butter. It's not like margarine. Paul Dean. Oh, Paul Dean the fuck out of it. Fucking all just butter. Butter it up. All butter. No, no margarine. That's one chemical away from plastic. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, don't disrespect Paul and Dean. So you say that was one friend? or five? What? Is that one or five over there? On the front? Yeah. One. It's one, yeah. So one, eight, four. One, eight, four, three, six, five, seven, two. Plug. Plugging. Um, they, none of the wires are melted or anything, though. Which is good. Yeah. I did check that out the other day after it melted a fuel line. And we were like, why? My dad was like, why are you losing prime? <laughs> I was like, I don't know. It was running the other day. And then it wasn't. And then it was. I touched the carburetor and it stopped working. So, uh, I figured out. Timing's definitely messed up. Yeah. And it, it has been. I've been finding that out after my TikToks went live and I got several comments telling me to put it in time. Yeah, well, it's blowing flames out the intake is not usually not ideal not ideal. i checked it it definitely has oil in it also so that's good well that's great yeah. it hasn't had an oil change yet right no it's on the menu mm -hmm. the future yep i gotta say these uh these radiator lines you like them um I'm in love with them actually so i i you know what you have to support me like you supported me when i was with my ex yeah. forty dollars that's what it can get you on Amazon. <laughs> wow. Wait a second. There's still one in that box. I don't think that was why. Why? There's numbers written on them. That's on the distributor and they don't appear right. 
Yeah, see, I didn't actually follow them. Good. I know the numbers are in the right spot. Yeah. Uh, I did follow the one to the one, and then I just assumed that since... You should have been able to reference the coil. You know what I did on the internet? Uh, I said that... Well, I do know what you did on the internet. <laughs> I try not to look at it, but... I said, I said on TikTok, if I hit 100,000, I'll take it to fucking mile zero. Mile. Thank you, West. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> you have to follow me in the GMC if it happens. Uh, you know what? I would do it. I would definitely do it. Yeah, yeah, the support vehicle is going to be the more reliable of the two trucks. At least my back won't be broken by the time we get there. I just think it would be fun. It would be. That would be. And, and not on the highway. Like, the long way. Oh, this, this thing's fuck. got 410 in it. In the rear. <laughs> It would be a hotel one, not a car sleeper. Yeah, right. <laughs> I've done I mean, enough it, car sleeping. I do have basically a couch. For this, so, but you know, that's like a it's like a thirty hour drive. Yeah, it's probably the, more than that. It's like not a, on the highway. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it's it's yeah, it's a good one. It'll be the, you'll never financially recover from the amount of fuel this one is. That's what I'm saying. I gotta get some sponsors before then. If I hit a hundred thousand, someone will pay me. If you me get a sponsor, it's sponsor. gotta be it's gotta be like like Chill. Golf yeah. or <laughs> Chevron. I'll or even it. I'll even take BP. <laughs> I mean, it's frowned upon down in you know the Gulf the Gulf side. Yeah. We're going. We don't, the other don't side. seem to like BP anymore. We're going. The, we're going the Keys. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. yeah. It was touching the header. No, it shouldn't be. I know. It hasn't got hot enough to melt it. It's not hot enough to melt the fuel line. Here's zip ties. Uh, yeah. Actually, I was going to say, clash. I feel like I should make a joke. I'm not going to, though. For the sake of the interwebs. <laughs> Better not put this footage on OnlyFans. Did you take this boot off? What boot? This part? Did I do that? I didn't do. I didn't do shit. <laughs> oh man, yeah, we're definitely not, not keeping you on guys. That uh, plug has exited the building. It's fine. It's the, it's the old one. Right? It's the old one. It's gone. So we don't care about that. You know what? And stay out. And stay, and stay out. We don't even want you. We don't want you. Hey, while you're down there, find my fucking uh, five sixteen fucking socket that I dropped in this engine bay a month ago. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, that should not move like that. Right? That's what I was thinking. Except for I wasn't, because I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, God. Will you go in? Oh, <laughs> I don't have my timing light. Fuck. Oh, that's it. Also, this this is not connected. That's what... It, I fucking felt that, and I was like, that feels like it's a piece of shit. No, it's just not... You didn't... You I didn't gotta, even take that one off. You didn't take the eight off? No. <laughs> God, shit. no. I didn't take any of it. There we go. Just one in five. And mm -hmm. one didn't even feel like it was. Did you hear it snap? Yeah. That's good. Oh, it's great. Uh, yeah, it's perfect, Tyler. Nicely done. Hey, I, I mean, <laughs> we, we both could have checked that last time. <laughs> uh, I wasn't here last time. No, no, I mean, like, when we got running originally. Oh, well, it was running. Uh, yeah, that's, that's, so I'm not going to touch nothing. You know, that's the problem is you, you <laughs> decided to touch it, and now it's, it's unhappy with me. It was... Happy being a clam. It was a happy as a clam. I heard it was the, happy as a clam. I heard the saying and I ignored it. Now it's a sweet special. Ooh, the choke works. It's not hooked to anything, but it works. Yeah, I couldn't find uh, anything to hook it. God, I wish I liked cars in high school. I would know so much about them. Does this not go full throttle? Oh, oh, wait a minute. We got we got some action here. Okay. Um, why are the is that vacuum secondaries? Uh, I don't know anything about oh, carburetors. Okay. I watched a video, multiple videos on how to take them apart and put them back together though, and I'm 95% sure that I did everything correctly. What is the best plan of attack here? From the back. I'm just gonna hit it from the back. Down, from, from behind. I'm gonna hit it from the back. You know what? He usually gets it done. Usually. When you need when you need to get to completion of a project, always always try you know, oh getting under there or hitting it from behind. Oh, I am moist. I'm sure you are. I got it. Did you? Yeah. I don't believe it. 
You it's think stripped you... now. You turned it the wrong way. No, I nailed it. Want me to drop a spark plug down? <laughs> Just drop it on my face. Just right on your face. Oh, rust. Oh. Oh, oh. Don't breathe it. I'm trying not to move anything but my fingers. Okay. It wiggles. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Let me give it a little, little weeble wobble here. <laughs> It is turning. Was turning. While I'm down here, these headers have some holes in them. <laughs> <laughs> Are you really surprised? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> There's so much oil on this plug. And there's a little bit of oil on this. Uh, Everything. <laughs> this is rust proofing. That's why it rusted at the top and not the. the that's why the frame is so good. Oh, but the rest of it is a rust bucket is because uh, it's got. Corrosion resistant um, weeping system. Well, this plug is actually really clean. Like the outside of it. Uh, and it's got some carbon buildup, but it's probably the best plug we pulled out. Of course. Then we could have left it. Yeah. You want me to put the next one back in? Yeah, I'll give it a little tighten. All right. Now that I'm completely soaked for one spark plug. Literally. Three. Nicely done. Just fucking. You did it. Drenched. Got, what, two more to do? Yeah. Anything, if I can just hear this thing run again, at least I'll get my motivation back. Yeah, we'll get it. To do the rest. Yeah. I'll probably get the shit shocked out of me, but we'll get it. Uh, shit shocked. <sighs> shit shocked. Shit shocked. Shit shocked. Kind of beautiful out. <laughs> right? <laughs> I was just, just thinking that. The birds are fucking the Birds happy. chirping. Man, people love this golf shit. <laughs> Happy Gilmore 2 is official. Oh no. They say they don't build vehicles like they used to, and that's why they rot into the ground. The reason that the old ones don't rot into the ground is because they leak oil. It's because they leak so much fucking oil. That that's why my house is not rotting out yet. <laughs> it's it leaks so much it's German. Fluids. And it leaks 60% of the time. It looks a little small. Oh, uh, the gap. Okay. I was like, I thought you said What did you gap it with? Before? Huh? <laughs> I didn't. Did you just, oh, I, you just of, that? I just took a piece of paper and ran it through there. <laughs> Do you want me to cap it? Well, it looks like it could use a little bit. I have a flat. Oh, that's like crushed. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I'm repairing the grill. <laughs> Zip that? I just went to go put the spark plug in backwards, so that's good. Well, I, don't I was know. never diagnosed with ADHD, but I can't sit still for long enough to start playing with things. I don't hands at the devil's playground. You know what? They say that, but I never left a woman unsatisfied. <laughs> yeah. There's always tomorrow. There's always a <laughs> glass plug, glass plug. I'm gonna do some finish up this body work while you do that. <laughs> Rebuilding the front end. Rebuilding the front end here. Yeah, make sure oh, you're doing the suspension? Oh, uh, no. no. <laughs> the grill. No, the grill. Just the grill. The front front end. The front of the front end. Look at that mint. All right, so we this got the tight. <laughs> this is even more. We, we got the last plug here, so let's gap it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See what it's gapped to right now. I mean, technically, isn't that just a gauge, too? It's it's, even there. It, Thirty-five, like yeah, thirty-five. Yeah, should be at like, shouldn't it be at like forty-five? Forty. My truck is forty. Who knows with this motor? Thirty-five's probably safe. Let's send it to forty, because I think that's closer to what the other ones were at. Sure. You know what, Tyler? Just don't don't fuck up your truck, okay? This thing is a specimen. I hope that's in. I. I hope it's it. Oh, okay. Oh, it's good. I hate for you to go down the road and see how something you know, like this grill wrap around. Yeah. That's going to be really... <laughs> Hold on, the tools. <laughs> That's how I lost my 516. All right. Time to steal the battery out of the golf cart again. Again? All right, what are we doing? I totally forgot. You have to use a hammer. 
make sure that they are nice and oh yeah look at that 4k yeah. resolution <laughs> do that to the car too just in case just a little tap yep she'll run now oh you found the starting fluid oh you lost the starting I fluid <laughs> i was joining the car again the uh and you're missing socket. <laughs> there's a starting party down there no the missing socket's gone i drove this thing down the driveway and oh, i couldn't yeah. find it anyway listen if i'm directly in the path of one of these fucking nasty old belts that will break and kill me slap you in the nuts. Ugh, just just the tip all right cool well i can work the choke from here too so and uh we need fuel right the fuel is up and i need to get the return got the fuel runners on the tank oh look at it Oh, so that's there. a return line. Oh, so this very is oh, it's cherry. All right. All right. Why don't you? Uh, I'll give it some choke, and you can crank it. Ooh. That didn't sound good. That's not good. Don't crank it. Just give it a. What is that? What is that? It sounds like metal on metal. Yeah. Like a lot of metal on metal. Everybody calm down. Everybody calm down. Let's think about this for a second. Is it the starter engaging? That could be. That's so loud. It's though. really, it's like really loud. Give it a bump again. I want to see if it turns because if it's... I think it just tried to fire. Yeah. But backwards. Give her a go. Just just a bump. Again. You got nothing? You got nothing? Hmm. Are you sure? Nothing looks weird down there. But I don't have any dash lights either. Right. So but this is you're literally your power is raised. So, are we sure? Where does this come? For the next hour or so, we would take our time going over all the wiring in the engine bay of the truck and trying to figure out where the power went from the battery to the starter solenoid to the starter switch because everything in this truck had been touched at some point and things were wire nutted together, running from different places in the engine bay through the firewall, um, and just it, it's kind of a mess. So we took our time and tried figuring out what was wrong with it because this truck was running um, just a few weeks ago and it was cranking earlier today and we were having not complete power loss but intermittent so we were trying to find out if we had maybe like a frayed wire somewhere or a connection that wasn't tight but we weren't having much luck finding anything so there's no continuity there so that's good it's not completely fried um So now we're going to figure out if we've got power somewhere else. Hey, I got fucking power. Do you really? Yeah. What did you wiggle? I don't know. What the hell? Holy shit. What? It's my fucking 5 sixteenths. Did you find it? Is, what is yes. it? Like hit the it's arm on there? the leaf spring. No fucking way. It's just sitting here. Holy shit. The truck giveth and the truck taketh away. It's, it's given you something. I'll give it back the 5 sixteenths if, <laughs> if it gives us back power. <laughs> yeah, it feels like this is connected. How about... You know that has power. Is it the solenoid? Yeah. Yeah? yeah it's, uh, it's the solenoid. Yeah. We did not get it running again. Uh, it needs a new starter or starter solenoid. I'm just gonna buy both because we keep hitting it. It comes back for a second and then we lose it again. So I probably burnt it out trying to start this thing over and over and over again. But at least I know it's not my carburetor. Allegedly not the carburetor rebuild. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Uh, I might work on this for another five minutes, but then I'm going home. Bye. Oh yeah, like, subscribe, hit the button, talk to Sean on his personal Facebook.
Don't do that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's it.